you probably sat down that night and you were talking to your mom about me and um, you explained uh, um, you probably said that I'm sick And, uh, sorry, I said I wasn't going to do this. And, um, maybe you mentioned the shit that happened with my brother that day and, uh, my son or, uh, <clears throat> My crazy ex-husband who tried to kill me, um, fuck. It could be a number of things, you know? Um, all of, I gotta plug my phone in. Um, all of which I have no control over. And I've had no control over. Um. But, um, as a mom, I get it, you know? <laughs> but I'm an honest person, and, uh... I had to be honest, and, um... There's only two reasons why you would stop talking to me. And, um... It's either that, or you have someone else. And, um... The way you talk to me, Chad. Um, I just have a hard time believing that um, you had somebody else. Um, you just don't say the things you said to me, you know? Just the little things, you know? Sending me a picture of wood with a heart in it. Um, I think you liked me and that you were into me as much as I was into you. And uh, I think that um, connection and that first time chemistry or, you know, that first connection like that and that instant chemistry um, is really hard to find. <clears throat> and uh, you know that too. And... Uh, yeah, it was scary, but, um, it was definitely worth it, and, um, I just, uh, wish you would have given it a chance, so, um, no matter what, uh, if you ever do listen to this, um, I just... Um, I'm sorry. Uh, maybe we can be friends someday. Maybe you'll, uh, maybe you'll, um, this is stupid. Maybe you'll uh, message me someday. I'm always there, so, um, I think you're an amazing person. And that little time I got to talk to you, you made me feel like I haven't felt in so long. I wish you would have given it a chance. And I'm sorry for whatever I did. But I miss you. 
and I wish you the best. Bye.